Hello and welcome to my channel. For those of you who don't know me, I'm Steph and today I shall be trying out a few products from Yvette Beauty. Yvette Beauty is a new to me indie brand based in America. I was so fortunate that she reached out and asked if she could send me a PR package. Um, of course I said yes. Uh, I didn't know what I was going to be getting. But I will just show you the items I received. I didn't use all of them in this look but they will be coming up. So the first up I have the Icing on the Cake liner palette. So these are water activated liners. Look at them. I am a huge, huge fan of water activated liners. Water, I can't say that. Water activated liners. I'm a huge fan as uh, if you're not new to my channel, you will know I love them and I love the colours that are in here. They are very kind of spring summer happy vibes. Um, but yes, so I have received that. So I also received the Infinity and Beyond Glitter Quad. And this is stunning. Look at that. I actually did use this black in my look today. But how beautiful is that? If you are a press glitter lover let me know in the comment section below i love them um yeah this is such a beautiful little curated quad so yes i have that and i have two of the single um glitters so i have candy which is on my eyes today um this is glow in the dark and I also have Runaway, again, glow in the dark, look at that. Obviously you can see I haven't used this one today, but how cute is that? And then, there's more, guys, more. So I have a little highlighter here. I say little, it's quite a size actually. It's quite a decent sized highlighter. It's in the shade Frost and looks like this. I love this marble packaging, I just think it's really, Kind of luxuri luxurious looking. I cannot get my words out right today. But yeah, it's a really beautiful highlighter there. So you will see that in action if you continue to watch this video. So I have here a Blackout Lash Adhesive Liner. Uh, still in the box. I haven't used this today purely because I don't like to use the liner like adhesive pens with glitter because I don't want the glitter to spoil them. So this is the pen here. It's just a nice thin black tip there. So that will be being tried out in an upcoming video somewhere. And I also have this long wear matte lipstick and this is the, the box. Yes, Steph, we all know it's a box. So the actual <laughs> the actual liquid lipstick herself looks like this. And this is in the shade La Vie en Rose. La Vie en Rose? La Vie en Rose. It will be in the description box below. Um, this is just, for some reason, the hardest thing for me to try and pronounce. But this is what I have on my lips. So, guys... If you would like to see how I created this look using a few of the products from Avet Beauty, and if you want to hear some first impressions, then just keep on watching. Okay guys, I am so excited to get into this, but firstly, everything I have on my face already will be listed in the description box below for you to check out should you wish to. Um, this is about Yvette Beauty. So firstly, I'm gonna go into the Infinity and Beyond Glitter Quad. This is, uh, here, let me open that up, look at this. And I am going to be going in with the black glitter. I, I've had my eye on it ever since it arrived. I'm just, so excited so i'm just going to be using a little morphe flat brush um because i do prefer these flat ones for glitter so i'm just oh okay well it picks up on a brush how does it apply to the oh oh okay now that is definitely beautiful 
that that's my kind of black glitter. Let's pop a bit more on. Oh, guys, this is sticking a treat. I am going to take it at a very slight diagonal. I do want to keep the black mostly on the complete outer part here, just to, I want to deepen it, but with the glitter. The, uh, the eyeshadows used were literally just to kind of give me a base because obviously I don't have any eyeshadows from Yvette Beauty. So uh, I know that she does sell eyeshadow palettes and I have had a quick look. Let me just grab a quick fan brush because I overloaded my brush a little bit there. Comes off super easy. Um, so yeah, I had a quick look and the eyeshadow palettes do look beautiful. Um, I am get rid of that. I am loving this. This is absolutely stunning. Now, obviously, if you are not a fan of glitters, um, then this isn't going to be for you. I need to stop overloading my brush. I'm getting so overexcited here. This is beautiful and it is just picking up perfectly on the brush. I hope you can actually see the beauty of this on camera. This is stunning. Oh, I do love a glitter. Oh, look at that. So beautiful. This is so pretty. Gotta love a black glitter. Right, so for the rest of my eyes, let me see if I can get hold of this without throwing it absolutely everywhere. So for the rest of my lids, I'm super excited to try this also. So this is candy and look at that. And apparently this is glow in the dark also. I cannot test that out right now because it's like the middle of the day. So I'm going to go in with another one of the Morphe ones. It's just the same as the first one. I do have two of them. Ah, this picks up better. Okay, so let's go for it. Oh, oh, what are you? What is that? I think that might be a heart. Okay, right. I've picked up quite a lot, so I don't know if I'm going to get all out here, but oh, look at that. Oh my god, the little glitters in that are just standing out a mile. <laughs> look at that. Oh my word. Okay. This could possibly want to be this could possibly be one of my new favorite glitters. I just want to kind of cover my body in this. Is that wrong? I don't think so. Look at that. Okay. I, I'm i officially in love with this glitter. I'm going to tap it over the edge of that black there. I probably will go back in with the black slightly, but just, just look at that. Oh, wow. I have no other words. Right, let's get the other eye down. Oh. oh, okay, I've picked up an awful lot again. I, it does all appear, I'm not gonna say it's too soon actually. <laughs> but it does stick very, very well when you press it on. Look at that. Okay, yeah, I'm I'm completely in love with this. Completely. Just wow. I'm sure they're little like hearts in there. My eyesight's horrific. Oh I can see a star. 
I just can't stop adding more. <sighs> now, I am blown away by this. Absolutely blown away. Oh, I can't stop adding more. Look at it. Just look at that. If you are a fan of press glitters, just immediately I've fallen in love with this. Obviously, you kind of need to love the colour too, but for any of you that know me, this has got blue and green sparkles in it, and uh, yeah. I know you can use your fingers for this, but I much prefer to use a brush. Put some more of them on there. Just look at that. Stuff getting carried away. Oh my word. Okay, I am... I am blown away by this glitter. She says adding even more. It's a star. You got there then. Probably shouldn't have that star there. Oh, where did my star go? Oh, I have a little star there. Let's stick you there. And I've dropped one here too. So let's get rid of the dog hair. I don't want, I don't know if you've got attached to a dog hair. And stick you on just there or there. Whatever. <laughs> I don't know. Right, I am. Um... I have to stop packing it on because I've packed on so much I think it's starting to <laughs> drop off the top. Just pop a little bit more of the actual smaller glitter over here. Wow. Okay, right. And then I'm going back in. Oh, God, that's so pretty. I'm going to leave that because it's got some on it. Right, so I'm going back in just a, a li with a little bit of the black glitter just to kind of tap it over the edge there. Oh, my God, I'm in love. I'm in love. And then back in with the pretty blue and green. Oh my word. So I'm going to quickly nip off, pop on some blush and lashes, and then I will come back to try out the highlighter and lipstick with you. So don't go anywhere. Okay, so liner, lashes, blusher, all done. I'll just let you know what it is I've popped on. So the mascara is the Madeja Lash Mascara from Madage Beauty. As always, the eyeliner in my waterline is the Colourpop Cream Gel Liner in the shade Prance. Um, the eyelashes are from Artitude Cosmetics. It is their luxury lashes in the style Baddie. And the blusher is one of my time favourites from Pout and Shout. No surprises there. This is Boozy Susie. And she looks like this. Absolutely beautiful. So I am now going to be going in with the Yvette Beauty highlighter. This is in the shade Frost. So I love the packaging on these. Absolutely love it. So this is the little component. And let me take the little plastic slip out of there. And this is Frost. Beautiful. A quick swatch on. It's a real icy highlight. I don't know how well you can see that. But we are going to pop some on my face. 
So let's have a see. Can you see? I think you can. Yes, yeah, so it's quite a glittery highlight, which I don't mind at all. As long as it gives the effect I want. It's a bit more buildable. Let's dip the brush in a bit. But it's very easy to just pop on a little bit um, if you are not highlighter mad like me. And uh, as Anki would say, I like to be seen from space. And I 100% agree with her. Because, uh, yeah, I don't even know why, I just do. I am swirling around a bit more in this because I do want the kind of wow factor. <laughs> That's what you call it. Oh, that is stunning. I am going to pop on some more because uh, I am feeling very extra today. And uh, you can probably tell that anyways. I was so, so excited to try these products. It is unreal. I'm just gonna pop a bit down the center of my nose and the tip. Yeah, there are little flecks of glitter in this, but ooh, look at that. She says piling on even more. Oh, so beautiful. Yeah, I think this is a very beginner-friendly formula, this highlighter. And uh, you have to really try to go overboard, like I'm doing, which is not a bad thing at all. A bit too much on the nose there. It's not a bad thing at all, because not everybody wants to kind of shine this much. And I get that. So that is highlighter done. Let me just take my blush brush and I'm just going to quickly just swirl over the edge so that they kind of blend in together a little bit. Beautiful. And now I need a little, 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 let's go for a little pokey one. So I've got a little Morphe tiny little pencil -y kind of brush so I'm going to dip in I am going to dip in and then spray my brush I think because I want the inner corner to be kind of BAM so swirl the brush around in there and then I'm going to give it a quick spritz I love this I love this set in spray it is the Catrice Prime and Fine Multi-Talent Fixing Spray. I love it. Anyways, let's carry on with what we were doing. I've got the shakes so badly today. Ooh. That is perfect. So I'm just going to make sure I drag it just a little bit up into the first bit of my eye look there. Make sure it blends in. That's really pretty. I do love, 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 love the look of this. All right, some more of my brush for the other side. Quick spritz. And I wish I could hold this mirror still. I'm <laughs> shaking so much yet. Never mind. It would appear it's both hands. <laughs> what can you do, hey? What can you do? Look at that. Oh my word. I'm kind of packing this on because, wow. Right, so now just taking a little bit, I'm going to pop just a bit up under the brow. Look at that. That's perfect. 
So just a little bit. Well, maybe a little bit more. That is stunning, absolutely stunning. So let's pop that away. And then to finish off the look, I have this long wear matte liquid lipstick and it's still in the packaging. I love how they've all got this marble effect. I think it's beautiful. Right, let's take her out of there. And I love the little component, look at this. It's like little bullet lipstick shape on the inside so cute this is in the shade la vie en rose la vie en rose something like that <laughs> it will be listed in the description box below and so let's pop some of this baby on oh it's one of those kind of flat each side ones so it will pick up more product oh It smells quite nice. Okay, I am loving this. This lipstick is so beautiful. I think it really goes actually with the eye look and also with what I'm wearing. Yeah, very, very happy with that so uh yeah so far i think everything's been an absolute winner the so this glitter here candy press glitter apparently glows in the dark also which just for me makes it even more exciting um but obviously i can't i can't show that at the moment um but i definitely will be testing that out this is stunning absolutely stunning you can see for yourselves how beautiful that is and obviously i've only used the black from the quad this is the infinity and beyond glitter quad um the black performed beautifully and these glitters they're not too wet and they're not too dry they're kind of perfect I thoroughly enjoyed it. The black, I think, looks stunning. Um, candy, I think, just looks out of this world. The lipstick, so far, I'm a huge fan. I love the colour. Absolutely gorgeous. And the colour is La Vie en Rose. I, I think maybe I'm saying that right. Uh, the, <laughs> the highlighter, shade Frost. This this is beautiful it is more of a glittery highlight which i don't mind personally i think it looks absolutely stunning it's made a perfect inner corner and brow bone highlight just so so impressed with what i have tried so far so let me just put those aside um so i haven't tried the blackout lash adhesive liner as yet um i don't tend to use these when i use glitter because i'm always worried that the glitter particles are going to stick to the nib of the pen and just wreck it so i haven't tried this out as yet but i definitely will be doing that um also this glitter here it is stars it is runaway another one that apparently glows in the dark just look this is this is me this green is me um but yeah so that is products used so far i i'm blown away absolutely blown away especially by the glitters but the highlighter the lipstick what more can i say i am in love so yeah if you are wanting to pick up any of these uh products that I have tried out today the link for Yvette Beauty's website will be in the description box below for you 
So yeah, I think that's about it from me for today. So if you've liked this video, please do give it a like, thumbs up. It really helps me out. And uh, if you're new around here and you love colourful makeup, you love discovering new indie brands, you just like chatty, get ready with me, play with makeup, then you're in the right place. So um, please do hit the subscribe button and don't forget to hit the notification bell so you don't miss any future uploads. So what's left to say? Nothing apart from thank you so much for joining me today. I hope you're all having a great day, a great evening, wherever you are and whatever you're doing. I hope you're taking care of yourselves. I will see you again very, very soon. Goodbye.